So here is my Transformer collection. Let me go ahead and start with this guy over here. This is Wheeljack. I remember having Wheeljack back when I was a, I was a kid. I remember getting him back in like second grade. He, he wasn't as articulate as this, but he still had a pretty cool transformation. I remember dropping him on the school bus and then I never found him after that, so. Let's see, I also got Perceptor. I don't know why people bag on him. Yeah, I mean, he turns into a microscope or whatnot, but his robot form is awesome. I mean, look at this. He's got like a huge fucking shoulder cannon. Really, it's pretty cool. I got Cosmos, isn't he cute? This guy's Ramjet. I got him over at a swap beat. This one I really love. This is, uh, this one's Starstream. I got him as a, as a gift when I was working at the Hasbro panel over at Comic-Con. Uh, recently, they did a Power of the Primes edition, which is gonna be like little robots, I guess, that turn into like engines. I don't know. These, <laughs> all these look like were like limbs with a with a another thumb on it. Jazz. I mean, it's Jazz, man. He's awesome. He was voiced by Scatman Crothers. For all those who don't know who Scatman Crothers was, he's the voice of Hong Kong Fui, and he was also in The Shining. This guy is awesome. Yeah, Bruticus. We got, we got Brawl, we got Swindle, we got Vortex, we got Blastoff, and this is Onslaught. And the gun is actually Shockwave. All right, over here we have, uh, we have Galvatronus. I also got Galvatronus over at, um, at a Comic-Con from the Hasbro panel. I love this. This is supposed to be Power Glide, and I'm not sure which one this is. I think this is Dead End from the uh, uh, Stunicons. And then we have Blades, and we have Streetwise, and then we have First Aid from the Protectobots. And this is actually Cyclonus. And I got Grimlock. I actually don't like Grimlock's robot mode on this. I like the original version. Then I have uh, Blitzwing. Uh, Blitzwing is one of the more recent ones that I got. I really like the way that they uh, that they uh, redid him. Besides Optimus Prime, my all-time favorite Transformer is got to be sh Six Shot. And yes, I can actually do all six. The weirdest story of all the Transformers is this guy right here. This is uh, Quick Switch, and um, he's a little happy to see us. Quick Switch is actually six sh shot. God, man, that's fucking a tongue twister, isn't it? Quick Switch is six shots son. Say that three times fast. So this is very interesting. They never actually touched up on this story. I would have loved to have seen some type of continuation in the cartoon of how Quick Switch is actually six sh shots offspring. But they, you know, it never got that far. We could have had a Luke Darth Vader scenario going on with this. We got uh, Mind Wipe. I actually don't like the way this is set up. The legs kind of are like hollow in the back. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of this one. And you can't have Cyclonus without Scourge. A lot of people have a hard time trying to figure out who exactly Scourge was before he met Unicron. And from what I saw, it was actually uh, Skywarp. And then Cyclonus was actually Bombshell. And then we got, um, we got Frenzy. Um, I call him Frenzy, but if you were to find him in the stores, they call him Rumble. It's not Rumble, it's Frenzy. Frenzy's the red one. Hasbro just needs to hire me because obviously they're having problems with their continuity. We got Baby Hot Rod right here. Or this is actually supposed to be Rodimus on the, uh, on the uh, packaging. It's Rodimus, but we know this is Hot Rod. I mean, Rodimus is a Winnebago. Speaking of Rodimus, or Hot Rod, I love the articulation of, the, of this version of uh, Hot Rod. I used to have the original Hot Rod and he, his arms were the only things that can move just from the elbow and the legs didn't move at all. So it was really cool to see how uh, they got this guy to like pretty much be like a G.I. Joe. You can, he was like, look at that, he's fully possible. You can move the waist for crying out loud. Got like this crazy karate kick going on. <laughs> and we got Optimus Prime right here. I, I like this version of him. Um, I'm not a big fan of these, these uh, this part right here, but man, just look at the articulation of this. This is awesome. 
Yeah, I like this. I don't have the uh, the gun that goes on top because it's actually he has like this this um, I don't know what the hell it is, some type of roof that goes on top of the uh, on, on top of the truck. But you know, I mean, I paid like two or three dollars for him at a swap beat, so beggars can't be choosers, right? Here's the original uh, Power Master Optimus Prime. I paid twenty dollars for him because at a swap meet. Some guy actually came up to me and said, hey, you know, I got this Optimus Prime, you know, it's not complete, I mean, it's a little broken, but, you know, he's got, he's got all the main pieces, you know, and he's got the guns, and so, somebody offered, you know, offered to sell it to me for 20 bucks. At the time, I was seeing him on eBay for $100, um, recently, only recently I saw him for 30 bucks. I'm probably going to end up getting that one if it's still on sale. And then we have the new Power Master Optimus Prime. His guns don't really stay on his, his hands very well. He doesn't have high Q. Instead, he's got like this other robot mode right here where the, the headless stuff, and look, look, it's Orion Pax, and like, ugh. No, no, I'm Optimus Prime. It's like, he's, got, he's, having, he's having an identity crisis. <laughs> this is the latest Transformer I picked up recently. I forgot the name of, of this of this female, but this is a female Dinobot. Isn't that cool? And uh, she turns into a raptor, and I just, I love the way this, this was a really small, you know, transformer, so it was only, I think it was only like 10 bucks, but man, it's a new Dinobot. So I was like, ah, okay, okay. Take my money, Hasbro, you jerks. I don't know why I'm calling them jerks. They did something pretty cool, really. But yeah, this is a uh, this is really cool female uh, female Dinobot. And, uh, and that's it.